Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer and these are the grinder gears. It's a gearing mechanism uh, that I've uh, developed uh, and I think it's new. And let me first show you how it works and then tell you a bit more about it later. So the grinder gears has only uh, three parts. We have a uh, yellow part, a green part and a red part. And when I keep the red part in my hand and I start turning the yellow part, you see that the green part moves as well. So it's a gearing motion that you see here and at the start uh, everything, uh, the arrows are aligned. I can show it also from the other side. Uh, now I keep the green one in my hand and I keep turning and we see the red gear moving in the other direction. So it's a sort of transmission and it uh, makes a lot of noise. Uh, let me show you uh, how this works. And the best way of explaining how it works is to uh, show you the gears and the red gear. You see my uh, signature here. It has 26 teeth and the yellow one has only 25 teeth. So when I turn the inner yellow part like this, you see it makes a very small rotation and every time that I turn around with my finger you see the yellow ring skip a tooth. So it's a very subtle motion, it's a completely circular one. I designed uh, the gears uh, such that it is uh, uh, circular and of course if you do it quickly it's a bit more like uh, skipping uh, teeth. So as I said um, here we have 26 teeth in the uh, red ring in the green ring we have 27 teeth. So if I make a full turn I have skipped a total of uh, 26 teeth. So at this ring I have skipped 26 teeth and I'm back at the starting position. At the green ring I have skipped also 26 teeth but it has a total of 27 so the green ring had to move. So this is actually uh, a transmission. It's a reduction from 1 to 27 or uh, when I hold the green ring, it's from 1 to minus 26. What's interesting about this uh, transmission uh, or this uh, gear reduction is if I try to move the green to uh, the red, it doesn't move at all. But even if you have a lot of force on it, you can easily turn it uh, with uh, the red one. So it is something, uh, obviously this is not suited for your car because it uh, vibrates way too much, but it's good to keep something uh, fixed. And actually the application is what is uh, my question of this mechanism uh, about. So the question is, uh, what uh, would you uh, apply this for? What would be a good way to, to use this? Um, so yeah, this uh, transmission it's a solution looking for a problem and hopefully you can find the problem. Thank you for watching.